Hey Roblockers, I am Sarah Orbis, and I hope you're having a pretty chill day today. And if not, you want to escape with us anyways. This should be episode 8? Episode 8 of Stranded Among the Realms, which is an extreme difficulty playthrough of Nightingale. And I just wanted to start and say this is an awesome view we got right here. It's nighttime and bits are chirping and the sky looks gorgeous and um yeah, pretty sweet. Uh, today, there's, st there's stuff I want to do today, and that is first, well, mainly, I want to go hop into a new realm um, and just kind of clean that place out. Probably a, a, I don't know, maybe a swamp realm or maybe a desert realm. I'm not sure yet. We'll figure that out later. Um, but before we do that, we got to do a little bit of house cleaping. Housekeeping? House cleaning? One of those two words. Um, yeah. Let's get into it. Oh, and also, the devs just patched the game with a major, not a major patch, but it's a big, chunky patch. Uh, 0 0.1.1, I believe. I think they fixed a bunch of stuff, and they made some really great improvements, and they adjusted some of the textures for our clothing. And I'll, I'll kind of show that off once we... Once the light shows up. But uh, you should go check out that patch. Um, you can check it out on Steam. I think they left a link for it. And also on their Discord. It's under game announcements in the Discord. Anyway, let's... Um, let's get on with the game. Uh, let's see, what time is it? 5.26. Ooh, it's dawn. Can you see the dog? Let's come out to our pier here. Or to be on this side? It's just, it's just phenomenal. This game is phenomenal. You know, it kind of gives you that a little bit of those No Man's Sky vibes where you have different worlds to go to and each one's kind of a little bit different. Now, obviously, it's not quite as varied as No Man's Sky, but this is great. Look at this. Getting dawn soon. Oh, that's just on. I'm wasting like wood. Yep, that's us. That's us. Okay. So, so I said I was alluding to the fact that some textures were changed. Oh, I can't see it because of the torchlight. But our stuff is red now. So the predator pelt is red, and I think the prey pelt is still kind of brownish. Hold on, let's see if I can... We may have to wait for light in order for, to see the, uh, the new textures. But, okay, let's, let's get on with the day, yeah? Yeah, it's way dark in here. That's still way dark. I think what we need are lanterns. Why? Why does it say we have stuff? Oh, we had stuff. We had night time Oh, uh, yeah, I spent a little bit of time just making some stuff. So we have a bunch of... Ooh. It's done. Oh, 
the sunrise, shall we? as well and truly surreal. Well unfortunately we actually can't breach too long for this. We have to get some we have to get our stuff done. Oh I'm actually uh, can we see clothing? No not again. It's still like crazy red from the like you Yeah, I definitely dig the color schemes. And yeah, I wish that, you know, this was a darker red. There were patches that were darker red. Um, same with the hand wraps. Like when you look at them, would I be? I would hope that there's more variance to the different shades. Just to kind of break it up a bit. Same with the um, this brown. Like they're kind of doing it here. But they should be adding darker spots as well. Like if we look at the pants, there's actually four different shades there. Four? Three. One, two, three. Four. Right here. Unless this is the same as this. Yeah, never mind. So it's three. Still, three shades is great. If only it was three shades of red rather than... You know, like a a tan, a, a flush, and a um, red, tan red flush. Still, I'm glad they did it, and it's like I feel like it's the maybe the first step to doing more with this. Hopefully, let's let's hope that they do more of this. All right, the day. I started and it's seven in the morning. There is one other thing we need to do and that is change our loadout. Um, I don't want this. Probably gonna need... Mm. Yeah, we don't need the sickle. May regret that decision, but oh well. And instead we're gonna take the climbing picks and the spyglass. Yeah. Because what I want to do is go to a different realm and just scout it out. But again, before we do that, I realize that there's something we need to do. Because so far we've been fighting a lot with the hand axe, or the axe, which is block with the defensive move. Mm -hmm. And we should start using these. We need to start practicing how to read with these. See, the problem with this is, as a defensive move, like when you're blocking, you don't take... Your stamina doesn't decrease until you hit, until you block. But when you evade, it always takes a chunk. Also, you can jump dash. So here, let's, let's demonstrate it. So we basically did a jump, jump dash there, which is cool. And we need to do that for, especially if we're going to be in combat. Um, especially against things like insects, where piercing damage is going to be what wins the day. I only wish this was two hammers rather than two climbing picks, but I, I get I get it now. All right, now before we do that though, we're gonna do one more quick test, and that is we're gonna make ourselves um, a portal again, because an idea struck me is that 
I think this is how they meant for the game to be, is that you can have multiple portals open to different places at the same time. And so all you have to do is like re reopen portals rather than play new cards. Now, how much did this need? 10? 10. 10, 7, 3, and then wire. Okay. It's actually going to be two different tests we're going to do here. We're going to reopen this portal and then open a second portal into someplace new. And hopefully... Ooh, they added a new, a new tab. That's pretty cool. And it shows what augments or what stuff it gives. Ooh. We should make the dog bed. Alright, for now, let's just make the portal. Is that backwards? I feel like it's backwards. It is backwards. Okay. Uh, move. Cannot be moved. Ooh. The uh, build mode. The icons are much larger now, which is nice. Okay, we got everything back. Try that again, shall we? This time, facing the correct way. So yeah, two tests. One is to have two different portals open at the same time. And two, you'll note that this suppresses creatures. And so I want to know if opening a new realm here will suppress... If this will suppress creatures coming out of this, this portal. Probably not, but we'll see. So, okay, so what I want to do here is open our old antiquarian realm in here. So I have no no playable cards. Okay. Wait. I thought Okay, I guess we need to make some cards. I'd sworn we made some desert cards. I guess we did. Let's also make some better paper. Wow, hardwood looks hardwood. Hardwood paper gives blocking efficiency, durability, and fuel duration. It's kind of nice. But you know what? We've got plenty... Plenty of this. So let's make... I, I don't know. What do we have? There were just three crude rocks hanging out? Really? gives us 48 paper, 15% strength, more blocking efficiency, fuel duration. Okay. In which case, let's make... I don't want to waste all that ink, but I think we got no choice. Because I want to see what Kentucky ink does. We're gonna need a lot more than that. Um, maybe not. We just don't have enough good materials for good ink. Yeah, this is fine. This is fine. Okay, now we got a bunch of paper.
Okay, let's make a couple of these, a couple of desert cards. Oh, that's gonna take a while. Okay, here I was thinking we could get through this quickly, but that's not gonna happen. See, I feel like... So if... If a bounce coming at us, they're going to swing wide, usually in halfway... Either halfway through the swing, or at the very beginning of their swing, they're going to turn towards you, which changes the arc of their swing. So what we could do is back up and sidestep, and move forward to attack their back. Um, or we could move forward and swing. The problem again then is like move forward while they're charging. I suppose we could try both. I don't know, we need, we need some bounce to practice on. It's also really, it uses up a lot. It's like 213. Every direction is 13. What about a jump dash? Does it also cost 13? Also, now question is: Is the dash percentage based, or is it always thirteen? I feel like it's only thirteen because it's twenty-five percent of fifty. Okay, so we made two desert cards. Make uh, two forest cards. So let's eat. We ran out of food so quickly. That brings us to 80. So if we if this takes off 20, then we'll know it's a quarter. Okay. 13? Still 13. That's good. That's an interesting number that they chose. Yeah. And we need two swamp cards, yes. Now we'll also need the measle we have to make an antiquarian card. Excuse me, excuse me, sir. You are destroying the forest. How rude. Just straight up leaving your trash everywhere. Did he... I think he destroyed the stump, too. Oh man. That guy. That guy. Just doesn't care about anything, does he? Uh, okay. Where are we at? Here. Oh, let's go change this realm's... Um, like, let's change the minor effect of this, this realm. Because we're not going to use this realm for farming essence anymore. We're going to use the antiquarian forest for farming essence. Uh, which way is it? North. Northwest. change color. These used to be blue. Oop. I 
might be forgetting our berries. There's boars here, so let's um, let's chomp up. Practice fighting with this for a bit. What if we shoot the baby? It doesn't seem right for me. Doesn't sit right. They don't have enough health to actually be a problem. So, never mind. That was pretty easy. That dropped Fabled Hide. And a Fabled Bone. Okay. That one was juicy. Okay, so what do you play here? Rated Eminence. Uh, no, we don't need that. Damage you deal, nope, we don't need to fly around. Uh, stone yield, Malefic, we don't need that. Harvester's Workshop. Um, I think this is what we do. The problem is... The problem is then our weapons will have lower damage. And I'm not sure I want that. Don't need duelists. Dragon's Horde. Enhanced blocking, but increased stamina. Not sure about that either. I think we do Artisan. Everything is kind of back to being greenish. That's okay. Let's just run through the forest real quick to see. Everything's pretty standard now, which I'm okay with. I'm okay with the Abeyance Realm being back to normal, quote unquote. Now, did that actually change what we have now, or do we have to make new stuff? Um. Durability 180, I don't actually know what durability was before, so. Sure. Okay, let's travel back. We're also gonna need what? Antiquarian card? Let's go, uh, let's make two of them. I wish you would note here in this on this page somehow whether these cards are 
major or minor. Pretty sure Utopia, Finvale, Settler. Like, I think most of these are, are minor, except for Antiquarian. But, all right. Okay. Let's sleep. Let's actually put our stuff away. Put that table bone away. We had a normal bone. Okay, we're going to need seven, two, four. Let's go six berries. Three and three meats. Just gotta stock stock back up on our supplies here. Everything's good. <laughs> Top knocking shit down, man. God. Okay, so first thing we're gonna do is going we're going to reopen the antiquarian forest in this one. Hopefully that'll work. Reopen portal. Good. Now this one will do a desert card. Oh, standby. Gotta uh, we reset the portal. And we desert. And we have to use antiquarian, so okay. Question is, will uh, Bound show up? Fingers crossed. I think we're supposed to be able to have multiple ones at this open at the same time, so it seems to be working. Bounder showing up. Very, very cool. Okay, 
I do like the parallax. Effect. Like you notice how it looks like the tunnel is actually like going in deep. Same with the small one. It's even better with the small one. Okay, let's go through this one. Yeah? Let's uh let's have the snack first. our map look like occupation running okay since traders were right here we'll go talk to him in a second wow there is nothing Ooh, a nice little uh campfire what is that what's that icon mean? you can chop it yeah you can chop it okay Are these going to be hostile? These are all pawns. Is that rook going to be hostile? Let's go private. I think it will. Sandstone. Hey, you gonna hit me? No? Maybe if I steal stuff from them. Oh, hello. I'm not gonna... I know you can attack them and get whatever they're made of. But I am... I don't... I'm not going to attack peaceful things. If they come after me, if that rook comes after me, then yeah, I'll take, I'll take them out, but I'm not going to kill the pawns. Or the... Ooh, Cape Allo. What's... What's screaming? What you carry? trees okay before we go there let's go look at this because apparently this is active okay bellow please It's just grass. Plant fiber with sticks. Oh. Okay. Oh, let's see that's so far away. too far away. This 
very um, damn intensive. was painful okay so well the axe is still the best tool to use against bound that's for sure hey really chewed up a lot of that health used up four or five healing healing cells that's uh, that's significant Is this a special tree? No. Oops. I don't think any of these are going to be special trees. Okay. Let's go in. So I'll miss about. Sounds scared me. I can have to fight more stuff. Thank you. 
new one, but where is it? Oh, right there. Scorpions, please, uh, excuse me. Not trying to mess with you all. This is your home. Oh. Okay, that's pretty cool. There's a bunch more around here, right? Yeah, okay, let's get, let's get, a. Uh, Let's get hung up on this little corner again. It's weird. Oh. Yeah. <coughs> Oof. <coughs> like the corners keep pushing. Anyways. You know what? Ever since I installed the newest NVIDIA drivers, I've been getting input lag. And... It's kind of annoying. even running the game not quite as high as before. You know what I would like to see? I'd like to see heat warping at a very specific distance. You know what I mean? Like in a real desert, you'd see uh, heat warping the air. And you get like those, um, what do you call those? Mirages. I wish you could see one out there. That would be really cool. It looks like there's a few of these. Whoops. In all different directions. That okay. Just some archway. Yep. Let's go look at that grove of trees. Also, we need food. Is that a boar? Okay. Oh, it's a scorpion. What kind of bug? Is something... Oh no, it's over there. Oh no, we killed a um a peaceful thing, didn't we? Oh no, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to kill your friend. I, I thought it, it was a boy, so um Oh this takes forty, damn. What about the tree also? Let's see what kind of wood it is. It's a thick wood, that's for sure. No jokes. It's some hard wood. Hard, thick wood. Eat. I know, it's hot. Hot, hot, hot. 
Hot, hot, hot. Tier two desert wood. All right. If only we brought our sickle, that's okay though. We're just scouting. We're not trying to get any. Um, not trying to load up. Again, real sorry about your friend there. Monarch Locust. Those are probably, um, Aggressive. Who was that? Is that copper? I think we're gonna need to bother some locusts. Oh, we don't have a pick. Never mind. Which direction is this? North? Go oh, this way. Alright. Who was that? Okay, we need to go down there. <laughs> well, let's see. What's oh, a 40? We're going to have to come back and... Um, it looks like copper to me. It's even got that oxidization that copper does where it turns green. What's this? Oh, this is just quartz, I think. No. This is 40. That's quartz. What is this? Salt? Yeah, we're definitely coming back with the pick. Okay, so this is a problem. I was hoping to use these, but if we're going to overheat, we need a better single-handed weapon. The knife really isn't. But we kind of need the knife for skinning, so we can't get rid of it. This might be our only option for fighting in the sun. With a with a one hander. No more dahlias, really? Is this anything? Marigold. May as well grab a bunch of this stuff while we can. I love the way this sounds. Get the locust chirping. It's just... That's great. What is this? Unavailable. Oh, this is their storage thing. Excuse me, pass the third, pass the third. Go mess with those locusts.
That thing is fast. Y'all dumb. All right, hey, okay, you know. That's what you want to do. But yes, the locusts are hostile. Sandstone, we don't need no sandstone. And they destroy stuff, which is interesting. When they land, they break things. Okay, are there any more? want to cut on get cut unawares while reading this a fugitive in the realms Kazia's journal a fortress of knowledge they call it and I just waltzed into the cocularium like it's nothing it took me all of an hour to get through the library and back hardly saw a soul and not one saw me would have stared started in this line of work ages ago if I'd known how easy it was I have the designs and diagrams just like they wanted now I wait for the morning shift to head through the NTCC, NTTC transept. Five guards watching it by now, but I'm well out of sight and they're more interested in their game of hazard than standing guard. First thing tomorrow, I'll be gone, no one the wiser. I haven't even set foot in the realms, but already I'm keen to get settled. No one looking to tell me my place, an empty, infinite swath of land, and a fae begging me to work for them. This couldn't have played out any better. The elephants will miss me dearly when they realize I'm gone, and I won't spend a second looking back. All that's left is to bask in the grand reward that awaits me when I hand everything over. Okay. There's a person of fortune there. Left? Oh, stones. 230. Oh, I like how it's growing out of the tree. The crystals are like poking out of it. It's so cool. Is that a doggy? No. Okay, let's go over here. Come play over here in the shade. Oh no. Man, it gets hot really fast. getting really tired pretty fast too. Probably run over here for fighting. Oh shit. Take it right there. It's twitching. Just like the uh Dicks. I think it's just because it was upside down. See like how it moves a little bit. I don't think it's supposed to do that, but it creeps me out, and they should do that. They should have its, like, legs, like, do that thing that insects do when you kill them. Uh, I'm creeped out by it, but that would make it amazing. I 
think we killed everything here. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Um. A little screenshot. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, we are hot. Just taking a look around. That that locust and cricket sound is just like ever present in the background. It's a little bit unnerving. Hardwood paper, I'll take it out. He wasn't happy, he's like, you took my paper. Sorry friend, you shouldn't have left it out there. You should put your name on it. Like, this is uh this is Phil's paper. Don't be touching Phil's paper. Where's that chittering coming from? We're done there in a second. We're going to we're going to check things out up here first. Interior junk. Is this worth chopping? Your hungers. Hungers upon hunger. We need to actually we need to take a rest. Crude cloth, lumber, regular lumber, and one carved wood. All right, maybe worth it. Expedition of the Realms, Quartermain's Diary. What is a life well lived? We should we should say this in the Sean Connery accent. But no, we, we shouldn't do that. Uh, that's a reference to um, League of Extraordinary Ordinary, Ordinary Gentlemen, which is written by um, Alan Moore. And in the movie version, um, Quartermain is played by Sean Connery. Anyways. Try to imagine that that accent, because I'm not going to try it. That, that, I'm not good at it. Uh, what is a life well lived? For myself, a life of quality lies in the nomadic impetus to explore and experience our world with the senses gifted to us by glorious evolution. Quarter means an evolutionist. Okay, interesting. It's uh, not a complaint. I don't think that's part of its original character. It is this impetus, impetus that compels me to helm another expedition into the wilds. Hudson Gordon had but to mention the desert realm before I found myself accepting with unwise haste. Hudson desired to map the desert realms, but lacked the more tangible skills of realm walking. Knowing his own faults, he also enlisted the help of Elish Ni Mautain. Mautain? Elish Ni Ma Mautain. I don't know how to say that. Um, for those who do, let us know how to do it properly in the comments below. Um, Elishni Matane, botanist and seasoned realm guide. Perhaps this trip will harden his soft heart, for realm walking is no flight of fancy. Excitement builds in my breast at the thought of the realms. Truly, one could not imagine a fate, worse fate than being shackled to a desk at the Diogenes Clump. Right here. A man born to explore. Anything good up here? Ooh, a chest. 
So we have an artisan card. Speed. Movement speed. Wonder if we can apply that. That's interesting. I didn't realize that the combo increased in damage. Is that something with this axe? Is it because of the magical strength plus thing? Oh, let's see if we can use this. Oh, we can put in our picks. Sure. Here, let's see. Yep. Okay. Lumber, reinforced leather. Alright, that's not too, too bad. Ooh, paper. It's not great. Oh, hinges, too. That's, um, that's not bad. Where do we get this? Hmm, we could probably get up there and chop that stuff down. But probably not worth it. Let's keep on exploring. like a little oasis. This is actually pretty be this would be really nice to live in this. And all it would take is for us to put um the foundation somewhere. Then we can take over the houses and this whole area. very cool. I was hoping to find a bed so we could take a rest. Let's, uh, let's look over there. Come on, hurry up. Alright, let's keep going this way. And then I want to make a big ring around this entire place. Hello, elephant. Druid's Lost Journal. In my search for Ludivine, 
find yet another, yet I find yet further correlation. She communes with the spirits through animal sacrifice. Though many of simple mind find this notion disquieting, we druids are no stranger to such practice. Before our order's suppression in the 16th century, the archdruid himself was called upon to sacrifice his life each year as part of a grand ritual, after which our next leader was named. That's... I was going to say that's harsh, but it's like, wait, let me think about that. This must be a fundamental event, the loss of which has caused our druidic magic to dwindle bit by bit. With Ludivine's lifeblood offerings, she has had more direct interaction with the realm spirits than I could ever dream. Any who would laud the scientific method, take heed. Here we have living proof that nature is truly infinite in its possibility, if only one knows how to wield it. And wield it she does. Would that I could see her work with my own eyes. It is decided. I will sleuth out her passage through the realms, and entreat her to work with me. Though I do not wish to appear over eager, I can scarcely imagine returning to my lonesome endeavors, though a practitioner of such confounding, awe-inspiring and awe-inspiring skill evades me. Dude's got a crush. Now it's time. 402. They look like baobabs, don't they? Baobab trees? Like, especially the short squat ones. If they were like huge and thick. If you don't know what baobab trees are, go look them up. They look awesome. Awesome. Are there... What's this? Okay. No locusts. I like that little peak hole. Oh, this is the same basic thing. Oh, let's go through the chest. Is it going to be in the same spot? Cool. Like that. Explorer imminent. Eminent. Travel more quickly, expand, extending the benefits of your meals and improving your resistances. That's very nice. I don't think I'm going to chop stuff down. Um, there doesn't seem to be much point to it. I mean, there's hinges and stuff that we could pull out of them, but we can get that anytime. And it's not exactly high level. If it was like, if it was tier two, then maybe. But let's not stress ourselves trying to get everything. You don't gotta be uh, all like loot hungry. What I really want to find are just more cards. That's really what uh, red like. Yeah, everything's pretty much the same here. Let's go back up. I really want to find some place to nap. That'd be really, really good. It'd be crazy if there was like a like a sand sandworm it just came up out of the ground and just gulp.
Let's leave the favor in here. We might need it for something later, and I'd rather have access to it than not. Because all we're going to use it for is like bouncing around this place and um... I'm not sure if that's going to be worth it. Man, we are so hungry all the time. I think possibly because I keep running too. Sun's still hot. Sun's not hot. I guess once it passes a certain point, maybe once it's not no longer above us. Okay, Rip, don't be attacking me. I just want all the juicy loots. No, attack, attack these things. Just to put something inside, because I want to test to see if it's... if it attacks me for taking stuff out of here. No? Okay. Oh, yeah, it is. Isn't that crazy? Okay, okay, let's put it back. Let's put it back. Okay. You happy? No? came after me. Don't forget that. Oh, we need a pick for this? Shit. No. That's okay. I even want their sandstone. Oh no. That's a lot of locusts. So, did it detect that we stole stuff and came after us, or...? Oops. Nope, that's not what I want. That's what I want. Or did you just notice us and then come after us? Go... So, let's go test it again. Let's go talk to this rook. And if it comes after us, we just run away instead of killing him, because there's no point. I don't. Oh, did he? Did he go aggro? Oh, we're going after these things. Wow. Let's um. I want to take advantage of this. Oh. Hey, fuck off.
gotta get that tasty bug meat. Cause he, that that rook, just shrewd to all these dudes. We're not gonna waste that. A lot of juicy bug meat and chitin. What a pillow? Just wanted to see what that was. Uh, I want to go around here and talk to the... Oh. Oh. Bet you there's insects in there. Bet you it's spiders. We're going to avoid that for right now. This is 100% not ideal. these climbing picks work. What is this? Oh, that doesn't look like quartz, does it? We're gonna have to... See, this looks like quartz. But it's got large... Um, crystals, but this doesn't. Are they both 10? Yeah, they're both 10. Um, yeah, we're gonna have to come back and get this, whatever this is. Alright, you're, you're tired, I get it. What's up, man? What you got? Infusion range. Let's get all this. We got plenty of cash. Um, card Duelist. Blood Moon. Like a Bramelin potion? What's this? Enhance the magi magician's contracts. Okay. Ooh, coffee. Belting bucket. Nice. Oh, second, second story. Still in set. Cool. Anything here? Nope. Oh, we got everything. Let's just double check. Okay, we got everything we can get from this realm. Man, that scared me. I thought it was some kind of bug. Like I just saw that part out of the corner of my eye. It looks like some kind of scorpion, right? Like made out of bikes. It just it just scared me for a sec. Okay, okay. I just I just got scared. It's fine. It's fine. Cool to admit. Uh, let's go look here first, and then we go. We go home. This is my curiosity abounds. Oh, another cave. Beast. Amatons. Hopefully, we don't attack. I'll take that. Oh no, found. Oh shit. Not what I want. Run! Run your ass! I'm not really trying to fight them because. Really? Oh, it's nighttime, that's fine. Okay, let's use. 
Let's just let's just let's go home. Let's go home. Being prepared. Okay. I'll take that. I look at it's not instant anymore. Although it means you can't just run away. It's also oh, come on. Lighter. It, wait, just those two? Two bombardiers. Okay. Also, I thought we would be leaving by now. Why isn't that happening? We are back home. I just wanna... I just wanna ogle like this. This is gorgeous. Oh, there's an aurora over there. I wish you could see it. Oh my god, this guy's whining. Stop whining about sleep. Just slug down some coffee. We don't have coffee. I think I'm going to call it here for this episode. I hope you all enjoyed it. Uh, we did a lot of exploring and got a lot of stuff done, which is kind of nice. Let's actually look off the sunset or sunrise here as we give our goodbyes for today. Um, yeah, we did a bunch of exploring, so that's pretty nice. I'd like to go back out there next episode. We're going to go back out there with a pick and grab as much of those minerals as we can. Um, let's see. We should also try and do some of those challenges. Uh, we can also try and go up to the... F Wait. I didn't see a Fae Portal. Let's go look for a Fae Portal next time, next episode. And we'll also grab a bunch of materials. And, uh, yeah. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll catch you all next time, alright? Peace.